Hello and welcome. Today I will show you how to set up a text to vote campaign. Log in to your account. After logging in, you will successfully reach the dashboard. Go to Manage Campaigns. Click on Add New Campaign. Clicking on Add New Campaign will bring you to a list of different types of campaigns. We will choose Text to Vote. Now it is time to set up your campaign. Your short code and SMS account is already filled in. The campaign name is required. This is for internal use, to help you organize your campaigns. A keyword, is a word added, before a user sends their text. This must be four or more characters. Now let's add some options. You can either number your options, use letters or Roman numerals, it's your decision. Type your option. Click Add Option. Continue to do that until you have enough options. You can either edit or delete your option. Now, choose a starting date and time. You also need an ending date and time. The maximum votes allowed tells how many times a user can submit their option. The voting question is just for reporting purposes, and is not required. Everything else is filled out for you according to your information. You can still customize the messages. This is all automatically filled. Do remember to put a reminder at the end of each message. Reply stop to quit. Message and data rates may apply. Click Save Poll. Everything has been saved. You can delete or change the keyword by clicking the red cross. By clicking Poll Results, you will be directed to a page showing what results you are receiving. Here are some ways to see results on your phone. This is only for you and not to be given out. To edit your campaign, go to Manage Campaigns. Click on the campaign just created. You have been brought back to the setup page. 
There is another, more efficient way to manage your campaign. Go to Manage Campaigns and click All Campaigns. Here is the campaign just created. This is to manage your campaign. This is to delete your campaign. This is to manage your subscribers. Now, I will show you what happens when a user sends their option. Here is the response. Let's see the poll now. Let's see what happens when the user texts more options. Here are all the sent and received messages. To see recent results, you need to refresh the page. Here are the new results. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.